Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a brand new release, 2020 Panini Prism WNBA Basketball, two box random team break number one from jazbeescasebreaks.com. All 12 teams are in, all cards um, ship, and we're chasing uh, Sabrina Ionescu, rookie card. She's with the New York Liberty. and some, uh, I'm sure we'll recognize some of the bigger names here, but makes its debut, makes its Prism debut, which I think should be fun. Here are the folks involved in this. Thank you. Appreciate it. There are the teams right there. Thank you. Appreciate the teams. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Two and a five, seven times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, we got Steven down to Jennifer. Two and a five, seven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and a seventh and final time. After seven, we've got Indiana down to New York Liberty. Liberty, Liberty, Liberty. All right, so Steven with the Indiana Fever, Brian with the Dallas Wings, Chris with the Las Vegas Aces. Darren, you have the Chicago Sky, Chris with the Sparks, Brian with the Phoenix Mercury, Chris with the Mystics, Brian with the Lynx, Darren with the Dream, Ryan with the Storm, Brian with the Sun, and Jennifer with the New York Liberty. Let's sort this by column B by team. And I'm sure there's going to be some good, uh, sneaky, good secondary market value in this. So keep it going. There will be some uh, WNBA. So our, our group breaks are from uh, the six loose boxes that we got. The personal breaks, which are on Instagram Live only, at Jaspi's Breaks, will be from a fresh case. So if you want to buy your own box, Jason will be live a little bit later today to, uh, to go with that. Any trades? No? Are we printing? Are we ripping? All right, TWC trade window closed. Let's print, let's rip. That's what the deal is right there. I'm not too familiar with WNBA stuff, but thankfully all cards ship, so if there's anything significant for your team, you will get it. All right, there you go. What's that? You want to buy the silver? All right, there you go. So you have a buyer. If uh, That would be Jennifer. The New York Liberty. Great value in here, folks, because this is the first time WNBA has gotten the Prism treatment, and so you know how how popular Prism is for for uh, the NFL and the the NBA. So imagine getting some of these rookies in their first Prism card. And WNBA is steadily growing, so there's some. I think there's a good low key value here. All right, Sean Jaspi is here too. If we hit a Mosqueda Lewis autograph. You're a buyer. Apparently, she went to modern day. What team is she on? All right, here we go. This is pretty cool. There's the hyper parallel. Everything ships. Not numbered, but it'll ship. This one's numbered. Diane Tarasi to 275. She's pretty good. There is our first rookie card of Sabrina Ionescu. Well, I think she had a 
She had a really bad knee injury, I think, just a couple games in. Which kind of derailed her, her, her debut. There's a cracked ice right there. Here's Katie Lou Samuelson in the red wave pattern here. I wonder if she's, uh, oh wait, I don't think that's numbered. I wonder if she's related to John Samuelson. He has daughters, I think. 60 out of 65. Derek Hamby for the Las Vegas Aces going to Chris Maxwell. The Diane Taurasi, by the way, goes to Brian Croft with the Mercury. Sabrina Ionescu, of course, goes to Jennifer in the Liberty. And our first autograph is Chelsea Gray. I know her. Los Angeles Sparks, Chris Maxwell. The gold is, oh, I guess it's not numbered. Maybe that's just the, just the way this particular design looks. There you go, Chris Maxwell, Los Angeles Sparks. There's Sue Bird. It's a vet silver. Let's see if we can find some rookie silvers, that would be nice. We've got a blue parallel here. Micah Herbert Harrigan, 60 out of 149. For the Lynx, the Minnesota Lynx, Brian Croft. No worries, Chris. Wait, who else is? Katie Lou is also modern day? Does modern day just um, some uh, basketball factory there? And there's our first rookie silver, Jasmine Jones for the Liberty. I feel like the Liberty, if I remember correctly, had a bunch of uh, had a bunch of picks that they had accumulated, so they got a lot of rookies in this. But well, there's Jasmine Jones for Jennifer, rookie silver. Hopefully, she ends up being a star. Ali, I think Allie Quigley did uh, one of those, didn't she do a horse competition? And she had like this, this fake dog in her backyard, which was kind of weird. There's Simone Augustus to 149 for Los Angeles. There's Alicia Gray, Cracked Ice. Brittany Skies, Red Wave, Alicia Gray to 275 for the Wings, the Dallas Wings. Yes, Dallas Wings, Brian Croft. And look at this, a Prism Hyper Sabrina Ionescu for the New York Liberty. Jennifer Lee with that one. There you go, Jennifer. Last spot mojo. Got randomized New York. And gets the number one overall pick, right? Yeah, the number one overall pick. In this year's draft. She could be the greatest. Yeah. There's a lot of hype around her. It's a nice hyper parallel. Ooh, yeah, TJ's like, where were these cards when Tulsa had a team? That would have been cool to see a Tulsa on a pro card. Yeah, it's kind of cool seeing the WNBA getting the serious prism treatment here. There's Nettie Carter for the dream for uh, Darren. That's a 275. And Brittany Griner autograph. I've heard of her. She's pretty good. Phoenix Mercury, Brian Croft. Gets the second and final auto of this box. And we got one more to go.
Another red wave rev here. Uh, Katita Alaska. Is Candace Dupree silver? Any more rookie silvers here? Rookie parallels? No, I don't think so. All right, one more box to go. All right, good start. We got a couple uh, INSQs. One was a hyper. It's pretty nice. Brad's asking, do you think the Raptors will play in Kansas City next season? Is that being talked about? I mean, I guess I guess this is in relation to to the pandemic and travel and all that sort of stuff. Yeah, I mean, they, they probably have to find a place for them somewhere. Right, that makes sense. Yeah, the Blue Jays had to play in Buffalo. So unless we get a uh, vaccine between now and December, I think, we're, I think there's pro significant progress being made from what I hear, but I don't think it's gonna be ready by when the NBA wants to restart in uh, late December, just before Christmas. And Boxing Day, so I think uh, I think they'd have to find a place at least temporarily. Is Kansas? What other? Uh, there must be other cities being talked about too. I, would, I mean, Seattle. Why Kansas City? Kansas City feels like a weird spot. No. When's the last time Kansas City had a team? The Kansas City Royals, maybe? No, that was not the basketball team. It was Kansas City Kings, maybe? It's Courtney Vandersloot. And we got Kayla McBride, 275. Casey's doing a full full court press. Seattle's not real, but don't they have a hockey team going in? Can't they just use that? Convert it to dot, dot, dot? No, maybe not. There's Brittany Griner. 10 out of 10 for the Phoenix Mercury. Brian Croft. Anaheim? Why would they put... I don't know if, I don't know if NBA wants three basketball teams in the... Southern California market. That doesn't make sense. And is that, that's a Sabrina Ionescu autograph. Nice. I guess Kansas City makes, yeah, I guess Kansas is pretty, pretty big, pretty big basketball loving state. Big in college basketball. If they pop an NBA team there, that'd be pretty cool. This is pretty cool. Jennifer with the New York Liberty. Excellent break for you already. You got the hyper Sabrina. You got the Sabrina Ionescu autograph and a Sabrina Ionescu base card. <laughs> Thank you, Megan. I appreciate that as much as it pains you. There's uh, Skyler Diggins Smith, 24 out of 25. Fireworks Mojo Refractor uh, for Phoenix, Brian Croft. Wow, just her base, Sabrina Ice Cube base is going for $50? Well, we got two more in the store, folks. Check it out. Two more boxes, jazbeescasebreaks.com. And we also have uh, personal boxes available with Jason on Instagram Live only, at jazbeesbreaks on Instagram. There's Megan Walker, another one of the many rookies for the Liberty. We got Elizabeth Williams to 149 for Atlanta. That'll be for Darren. There's uh, Asia Durr, Cracked Ice. Is 
There's Jocelyn Willoughby, rookie Red Wave, and Astu Nadur to 275, and a Dewana Bonner autograph. And that is for, I think, the Connecticut Sun? Yeah, that's the Connecticut Sun right there for Brian Croft. The Astu Nadur goes to Dallas, and the Jocelyn Willoughby will be for the Liberty. Yeah, remember, they had, a, they had a ton of draft picks this year. I don't know how they accumulated it, but good on the front office for kind of rebuilding that team. There's Brianna Stewart. Another INSQ base card for Jennifer and the Liberty. Maybe one of these could grade out really nicely. Candace Parker. Got Skylar Diggins Smith to 125. And Diamond to Shields at the very end. And there you go. This one will go to the Phoenix Mercury, Brian Croft. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. WNBA getting the prism treatment, ladies and gentlemen. So check it out. We've got more on jazbeescasebreaks.com and more on Instagram Live at jazbeescasebreaks. Check it out. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.